Yo, hi guys, it's me again, Betha Glassy. And if you're new to this channel, please do support me by hitting the subscribe and hit the notification bell and select all na rin so that you'll get notified if I have a new video, okay? So, our vlog for today na i-share ko sa inyo is uh, yung mga kagaya ko na nag-struggle na hindi pa rin nakakatanggap ng Google AdSense pin na sinend sa atin. So, uh, this tutorial is ginawa ko sa aking uh, YouTube channel. So, baka kailangan mo rin ito gawin. Kasi... Uh, dito sa atin, yun yung nai-issue na walang dumarating na Google AdSense pin, although kahit may sinet na sila sa atin di pa rin natin natatanggap and yan yung last na requirements ni YouTube para i-verify natin yung address natin na tayo ay tao, tayo ay may bahay na inuuwi yan, ganun lang yun, hindi tayo robot, so yun lang yung, uh, yun lang yung uh, point ni YouTube doon so kung wala tayong natatanggap na Google AdSense Uh, within 4 months and then hindi, hindi natin bine-verify bine yun sa ating uh, Google AdSense account, mawawala yung uh, ads ng ating uh, videos or mawawala tayo sa YouTube Partner Program na yung monetization. Ayan, so, uh, start na natin. So, in my case kasi, uh, kamomonetize lang ng aking uh, YouTube channel last November 2020 and about 2 weeks or 3 weeks uh, may naipon na akong $10. So, at least guys, may $10 and above ka bago ka Bago sila mag-send ng uh, Google AdSense PIN. Ayan, so, November 21, may email akong na-receive from Google AdSense na nag-send sila sa akin ng Google AdSense PIN. So, hinintay ko hanggang December 20, December 21, wala pa rin. So, nag-request ako nung December 21 hanggang January, hinintay ko wala pa rin. So, nag-request ako ulit ng January 21, wala pa rin. And then, February, nag-request ako ulit, wala pa rin. So, hanggang parang March yung taning ko, yung 4 months na yon na at least i-verify ko yung PIN para... Uh, mag uh, go through yung yung advertise yung ads ng aking uh, videos ayan syempre kinakabahan ako nag-request ako ulit ng February 21 wala pa rin so nag uh, decide na akong mag uh, manual na lang so start na tayo ah uh, gagawin ko dito and then uh, i-screen record ko sa inyo and then sundan niyo na lang yun guys okay all right so first na ginawa ko is uh, pumunta ako dito sa aking uh, dashboard YouTube Studio para i-copy ko ang aking uh, AdSense account uh, ID. Ayan. So, i-copy mo yan, guys. Ha? Dapat nasa clipboard mo yan. Okay. Ayan siya. Kasi nung sinend ko, guys, February 21, kinabukasan ng February 22, uh, naisipan ko nang mag-manual. Mag Ayan. Okay, copy na natin. And then, next is, uh, punta na tayo sa, ayan, punta na tayo sa AdSense. Ayan. So, search mo lang siya. And then, ayan, click mo lang yung Google AdSense mo. And then, i-direct ka na sa iyong Google AdSense account. Okay, so ang makikita, makikita niyo lang is ito since uh, bago pa lang ako and wala pa akong naiipon and hindi pa siya nag-update. Yan lang yung makikita niyo. And then, makikita niyo yung three dot na yan, i-click niyo lang. And then, click niyo help. I-direct ka ulit. Ayan. So, ito yung kalalabasan guys. Basahin mo lang yan. And then, kung tamad ka magbasa, sundin mo lang lahat yung aking kiniklik. Ayan. Having problems with your PIN. Ayan. As the help community. And then, sa baba, basahin mo lang ito, guys. Address PIN, verification, address PIN, overview, enter PIN to verify your payment address. So, ang ikiklik mo dito is itong problems with your PIN. Ayan. So, i-click mo lang siya, i-direct ka ulit. And then, address pin, verification problems with your pin. And kung basahin mo lang yan, basahin mo lang ito lahat. Kung tamad ka, sabi ko, sundin mo lang. So, mag-pin troubleshooter tayo. Click mo lang yung pin troubleshooter, i-direct ka ulit. Personal identification number, troubleshooter. So, basahin mo lang yan. Check, your, check that your earnings are great, greater than $10.00. Ayan, basahin mo lang yan. And then, kung may at least $10 and above ka na, i-click mo lang yung yes. Siyempre, binabasa pa natin. Ayan, then i-click mo lang yung yes and then ganyan na yung lalabas. Basahin mo rin, have you received your PIN to receive payments for your AdSense account? Your publisher have to verify their address by receiving and entering a personal identification number. Ayan. So, syempre, i-click natin yung no. Ayan. So, have you already requested for repl replacement 
pins. O syempre, uh, multiple na yung ginawa kong pag, kung dapat naka-multiple uh, request ka na ng uh, pin kay Google AdSense, ayan. So, syempre, kiklik natin yung yes. So, yan yung lalabas. Wait, pasahin ko ulit. So, click natin itong contact us. Ayan. So, after you you answer the question, i-click natin yung contact us. Ayan. And then, dadirect tayo dito. Ito yung uh, fill up natin, guys. Ayan. Personal identification number. So, bago mo gawin ito, guys, make sure na sa iyong uh, photo gallery, may nakasave ka na doon, may nakaready ka ng uh, picture. I, I mean, I mean uh, identification card mo na government siya. Gover I government ID. Ayan. Na at least, uh, klarong-klaro na may uh, full name ka and may address ka na nakalagay doon. Para hindi ka na mag-struggle once na nag-apply ka na dito. So, syempre, susulat ko yung tamang pangalan ko. Ayan, yung pangalan ko. And then, yung uh, Gmail account mo. And then, i-paste mo na dito. So, your AdSense publisher. So, dito mo na i-paste yung tinuro ko kanina. So, umpisa na, kinapin mo. Ibig sabihin, ito yung uh, uh, ID mo. ID mo as publisher, as host, as uh, YouTube, YouTuber, ganun. So, ayun, i-send natin yung photo. Yung ID ko, ayan. So, ang binigay ko is, yung binigay ko is yung driver's license ko. Ayan, so, it's downloading na. Click okay na. And then, after that, click natin yung submit. Okay, syempre, uh, dapat basahin mo rin siya. Oops! Wait. Ah, may enter. Dapat pala, hindi na, hindi kasali itong ID. Dapat nag, pag, nag-paste tayo dito sa your AdSense publisher ID. Dapat pala, tanggalin yung ID. Dapat nag-start na siya sa PUB. Ayan. So, dapat PUB. And then, yung uh, dash and then yung number. Huwag na, hindi na pala kasali yung ID. So, dapat ganito siya, guys. Ganyan siya. Ayan. Ganyan siya. Tanggalin yon And then, i-resubmit natin. Ayan. So, nakasubmit na, guys. So, the form has been submitted to AdSense support. We'll try to get back to you within 24 hours. If, if your query is about your own account and requires an action from our side, however, depending on the volume of messages, that we receive, it may take up to 48 hours or longer for us to reply. Thank you for your patience. Yun sabi nila, in my case, sabi nila 48 hours. So, pero, after that, after nun guys, pagka send ko pa lang sa kanila ng submit, meron na agad sila email sa akin. May reply sila sa akin agad. So, ang saya-saya, wala hindi na ako nakintay. So, pinasa ko yung uh, email nila. Ayan. Ibig sabihin, okay na. Voila, okay na. Okay na ako. At least, kinonfirm na nila agad. Which means na enter na agad yung uh, Google AdSense pin ko. Ayan. So, eto na agad yung dumating. Papakita ko rin dito sa inyo. And then, eto yung dumating na email nila. Parang uh, idediretso ka sa payments. Ibig sabihin nito, ayan, i-click mo lang yung uh, form of mode of payments. I-dadirect ka na. Which means tanggap ka na. Nareceive na nila yung... <clears throat> So, itadirect ka and then i-click mo lang yon. Ito yung mamimili ka form of payments and then i-click mo. Oh my God, paulit-ulit lang yung sinasabi ko. Wait lang ha. I-click mo lang yung form of payments and then itadirect ka ulit. Ayan. Yeah, and then yan, yan yung lalabas. Payments set up for your form of payment for AdSense. And then mamili ka lang. So, yan yung mga mode of payments nila. Check eh. Uh, electronic funds transfer. Ayan. Pero, ito yung napili ko and na-search ko na uh, okay, so wire transfer. So, ibig sabihin, ito yung i-connect mo siya sa bank account mo dito sa Pilipinas. Any bank will do. Sabi nila, sabi nila, BDO lang pwede. No. Kahit uh, any banks, basta international siya. Ayan. Kasi in my case, yung kinonek ko is uh, PNB. Ayan. So, nag-sign in ako. Click mo lang yung sign in. And then, idadirect ka sa Google AdSense account mo. 
Ayan, so nakita nyo guys, na verify na ang aking, uh, verify na yung billing address. Ayan, so your billing address has been verified. Ayan, so congrats, congrats sa akin. Ito guys, uh, within a minutes lang, uh, not even hour na nag-reply sila sa akin. Na nag-email sila sa akin, I mean. So, ayan na siya. And then, ikiklik mo lang yung tatlo na yon And then, punta ka sa payments. Loading, loading. Ayan siya. So, yan lang yung makikita nyo sa akin. Maliit lang siya kasi nga, hindi pa siya nag update Ayan na. So, add payment method. Ayan. So, i-click mo lang yan. How you get paid. So, i-click mo lang yan. So, click mo ulit yung add new wire transfer details. Ayan siya. So, fill up mo lang to receive payouts by wire transfer. Oops, wait. Na-click ko siya. Wire transfer, contact your bank for exchange rates and fees. Bank account must be located in the Philippines and in U US dollar currency. Uh, kahit ano guys, basta international yung bank na yun. Okay? Yung bank nyo. So, beneficiary ID. So, optional yon, It's up to you. So, ayan. Uh, name of bank account. Ayan, inilagay ko yung akin. yung pangalan ng bank mo, ayan, PNB. And then, uh, dito sa SWIFT na ito, uh, madali lang ito guys, syempre, google tayo, ayan, so, ginugal ko yan, bago ako nag-enter dito, ibig sabihin, it's like, ano lang siya, yan yung SWIFT uh, code ng PNB, i-google mo lang siya, ibig sabihin yan is, uh, parang, uh, code siya, na yung bank mo is, Philippines, something like that, ganun lang yung uh, uh, meaning nun, so, for example, Yan kasi yung, uh, eto kasi yung code ng PNB. So, for example, uh, Metro Bank or BDO ka, isa, i-google mo lang siya, iisa lang yung code dito sa Pilipinas. In, hindi ibig sabihin na porkita, porket PNB ka, pero yung location mo is sa Manila, sa Mindanao, sa Cebu is iba-iba, uh, iba-iba yung code. Hindi po, iisa lang pala. Isa lang yung code ng uh, PNB, SWIFT code PNB ng Philippines. Ayan. So, enter mo lang yung account number mo. Sana nasusundan nyo guys, no? <laughs> Ayan, so enter mo lang yung account number mo. And dapat, uh, tama lahat. Recheck nyo. Tama yung spelling. Tama yung numbers na ini-enter nyo. And sya. And then, i-retype natin. Ayan, and then, after natin na fill up an lahat ito. And then, syempre, nire-recheck natin. Isi-save na natin. So, so, ganito lang kadali, guys. So, wire transfer to bank. So, nag-connect na siya. Ayan. And, ganun lang kaisi, guys. Ganun lang kaisi pala mag-verify uh, ng pin troubleshooter. Ayan, so. Okay na, guys. And, sana nasundan nyo ang aking mga uh, tinuro or ginawa sa aking uh, YouTube channel and thank you for watching bye bye and god bless